Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is your Wild Wild Girl here. So, we are done with the Shavin Trials. Uh, first off, for those of you that are new, welcome to my channel. I am Tara, your Wild Wild Girl. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button and like my videos. And if you have any comments, I would love to read them and reply. So, let's move on. So, Shavin got three counts... Um, three charges that he was found guilty for. Now, seeing that how he is a police officer for murdering someone, basically he is about to probably get 9 to 15 years for murder on live TV that everybody saw him. He cannot deny. Uh, why am I whispering? Okay. So, out of those 9 to 15 years, he's probably going to serve 5 or less. Um, I know with Rodney King, and that beam that he took was live streamed by the helicopter. And all those men were found guilty. But then they were all acquitted. So, um, again, Chauvin is white. He is a police officer. Um, he will... And I did tweet about this um, a couple days ago. So he will never see general population. He will live like a king in prison. And then he'll be able to get his pension. Now, is that fair for taking a life? No. No, 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 no. But it will happen. Because he is white. And that's the sad part about it. So, really, what justice are we getting here? None. None. The fact that he's going to be off the streets for a couple to a few years. And then today to find out that he has 22 open investigations. This man sat on a 14-year-old young man on his neck and his back for 17 minutes. A black teenager. Was that ever spoken about? No. How about the other 21 investigations? No, because again, he is white. And he is a police officer. So basically, if George Floyd, um, if that didn't happen, we would have never known about all of these other investigations and and it's sad because George Floyd should have been here today Trayvon Martin should have been here today Tamir Rice should have been here today Philando Castillo should have been here today Breonna Taylor should have been here today um Makia Bryant should have been here today the gentleman from North Carolina. He was in his driveway. Pulling out to go somewhere. Not Probably not knowing that the cops were there for him. Ten shots. Ten shots. This man took ten shots. And the shot that killed him was the blow to the head. And now they're showing the video in parts. But again, just like, um, oh God. To say the George Floyd video, when, um, again, and I'm still sticking with this, this was personal between Chauvin and Mr. Floyd. To me, I think he was never going to see the light of day. 
Um, as far as I knew, they bounced together, what everyone said. But when he was getting into the car, he said, I'm claustrophobic, I'm claustrophobic. He knows that. He knows that. That means Chauvin knew that. So Mr. Floyd was never going to see the light of day regardless of the fact. That's why he was so comfortable with his hand in his pocket. And that was my first instinct when, when I saw that video the first time it aired. And I saw his hand in his pocket and I'm like, yo, this cop is comfortable. Like he knows him or like he's just that racist to be like, oh, <laughs> this man going to die today regardless or whatever it is. And he didn't care. So in actuality, there, what justice do we get there? That he was found guilty on all three counts? The maximum he could get is, what, 40 years? Then I gotta give him that. Because like they said, um, he has no prior... He doesn't have a dirty history. But it's got 22 investigations open for standing on people's necks. Um, so, yeah. Chauvin will not see prison for long. I promise you that. Unless by the grace of this God, um, but that they happen, the judge happens to give him life, and he won't. Um, the judge looks kind of iffy, too. So he'll probably come back with like a five to nine year sentence because he has no priors because he's a police officer. So that makes it okay for him to get away with murder. Um, it's, it's, it's going to take a while. It's going to take a long, long, long time. And we're in the flipping year 2021. Cops are getting away with murder. But trust me, he'll get his because one, or the, one way or the other, if it doesn't happen in prison, he's going to come out and somebody's going to recognize him unless he barricade himself inside the house. So that's the only justice we'll get. All right, guys. So. I'm going to upload this video. Uh, my next video will be on Makia Bryant. Um, I hope you guys um, stick around. Right, I'm gonna watch on. Um, stick around to watch that video. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so that when I do make a new video, you guys will be able to um, see it first. All right, remember, COVID is real. Please, guys, put on your mask in your car. Take it off when you get back into your car hand sanitized because you don't know whose conversation you're walking into. Like today when I was at Publix and I'm sitting in the car waiting and I see this, um, he's an old guy, senior citizen, probably about in his 80s. And he walks up to the door in Publix. And see, this is the thing that makes me so like, his wife walked past him, like she's going to go in the car and wait for him, who has no mask on at all. And she was already in Publix and came back out. He goes in he gets to the door and he puts on his mask and walks inside. So, like, what is the purpose of that? Because she's not wearing one, but then you wait till you get to the door. Where everybody's been talking and walking around without a mask, on their cell phones, talking to each other. Doesn't make any sense. And then you want to know why you caught COVID. Look at what's going on in India, guys. This is real and it's killing people like crazy. The only way to survive is to quarantine. And if you have to go out, double mask. Please get vaccinated because they say with the vaccinations, at least if you do catch COVID, you won't die. You're more likely not to die. Unfortunately for me, uh, I did get my first shot and I have to wait um, till the 29th to make another um, appointment for my second. And I got Pfizer. I mess around with Johnson Johnson. All right, guys. So I'll see you in my next video. Take care.